The Zimmerman case has been an eye-opening experience for many Americans. Some actually believe that ours is a system of justice based in truth and logic. Instead, we have been confronted with the harsh reality. Our legal systems, like the legal systems of any other nation or empire since the dawn of man, are based upon fatal flaws. They are the inhumane imperfections implanted in all of us when we are young, naive, vulnerable, and extremely pliable. Those flaws are the biases and prejudices that rule the intellect of even the most learned justice, attorney, officer of the law, and certainly those elected and charged with creating laws. It is first and foremost important to understand that a seemingly ceaseless number of the laws that are created in America are not grounded in logic or in an earnest quest for the truth. They are the product of emotions, jealousy, fear, mistrust, and even hate. A countless number of our laws are based on control of one group to meet the special interests of another. Unfortunately, those who are writing the laws are consistently at the mercy of the biases and prejudices that faithfully allow them to think and believe that the wants and needs of their particular group take precedence and are therefore superior to any other. From the town and the state level to the mighty Supreme Court, the needs and wants of a small, vocal, and powerful minority consistently prevail over the needs and wants of the silent masses. Thus, the inequities and illogical devotion to rules, regulations, and laws that are inherently destructive to the very fabric of society will prevail. They will prevail until we as a nation sincerely begin to exercise the twin demons of prejudices and biases. Is the task insurmountable? Can the human species actually evolve into a humane life form?